So it is a Tuesday and it is a skinny, so what are we going to start with? But the ballroom, Dancing with the Stars, um, episode that always means a lot of tears. The most memorable year episode. That's right. Lots of Kleenex mm -hmm. in the house all throughout the night, but especially when Olympian Nancy Kerrigan revealed her years of trouble having a family. Her foxtrot got a nine from Len who said she's now a front runner. Yeah, it was a tough battle. She talked about it. And then there were some Alden Biles who started her dance crying and ended it bawling. <laughs> her most memorable year was when she got adopted by her grandparents. The judges loved her waltz and gave her the second highest score of the season. Her grandparents were there as well and she received her scores and everybody in tears. It's such a beautiful story and you got yeah. to see that all throughout the Olympics. She would talk about them mm -hmm. constantly and they were always there watching her. Yep. Uh, meanwhile, Nick Vile lightened <laughs> things up a little bit for those who needed a few laughs. His most memorable year, 2017. Because, well, that was his time as The Bachelor. So he performed a rumba. <laughs> <laughs> he was shirtless for most of the dance. Got his best score of the season. What say you, Bachelor analyst? Uh, well, let's move along. <laughs> let's just say his most memorable year is Jack's least memorable year at this point, thanks, because he had to live through Nick Viola as a bachelor. Um, bull rider, Barner Bolton, has been overshadowed a little bit this season, but he shared an incredible story of being paralyzed just a year ago, and he got his best score yet. Very cool, but it was running back Rashad Jennings that brought the house down. His dance was about his dad not being there for him as a kid, and the judges were just blown away. They called the performance more art than dance. And he ended that dance also just sobbing into wow. his father's arms. He scored wow. a 39 out of 40. I don't think he owns a full T-shirt. I am not mad at that. <laughs> totally fine We're going that. on four weeks now where we've seen the abs. But no, what a wonderful moment there for Rashad and his dad. It was really an emotional night overall. Yeah. Um, but someone had to go. Mr. T and Kim waltzed to Amazing Grace, getting his highest score of the season. It wasn't enough. He got a standing O, though, from the crowd. Well, and everyone, I mean, they love him. They, you know, yeah. even if his nice dancing guy. is not quite at the same level as everybody else is. I think everyone was really sad to see him go. In yeah, and as he points out, he's like, I told you I'm not good at dancing, but there he is. But he's good at entertaining, and yeah. thank you for that, Mr. T.